Hi folks, Richard Ash, Folkcraft Instruments. Today's dulcimer demonstration is of a Folkcraft FSH series mountain dulcimer, serial number 8030371. This instrument has a walnut back, a walnut top, walnut scroll head, walnut heel cap, and then maple sides. I found a beautiful piece of curly maple to use for the sides on this one. And it looks like it's got waves like water with waves in it. This is actually very, very smooth. You run your hand along it, you don't feel those ridges at all, but it's just, it's just a visual effect. It is a book matched piece, so the two sides match each other 100% as far as the book matching. And the curl, oh my goodness, this is a spectacular piece. If I could find enough to make an entire instrument out of it, that would be a premium instrument price-wise for sure. But I have one piece, one beautiful side set. I wanted to use it, so whoever gets this instrument is going to get that. The fretboard itself, of course, is made out of sugar maple, same, same as the sides, only the fretboard. We were going for plain quarter sawn, so we want it to be very stable so the instrument doesn't bow or dip when the temperature and the humidity changes over the seasons. Anyway, this instrument has a 27 inch scale length, so from nut to bridge, 27 inches, fit pretty much anyone's hands, does have the extra one and a half, eight and a half frets. Four strings on the scroll head, or four tuners on the scroll head, we did set it up four strings, D-A-D-D -D -D tuning. Very small, or very traditional body, not the great big giant folk roots body, but the traditional folk craft body. I'll play you a couple of tunes here. Shenandoah and Wildwood Flower, here we go.